Today, Music Monday is all about bringing back R&B to Detroit, and we're introducing you to a group who is making this their mission. Joining us is singer Unique Nico Noir Stewart and producer Ricardo Cardo Morgan. Welcome to Live in the D. Thank you for being with us. Thank you for having us. Well, it's my pleasure, but let's, let's get into it. Now, we often hear people say that they want more R&B back on the radio, especially like that 90s R&B feeling. Tell us why you made this your mission and why you want to bring R&B back to the forefront. Well, I think, you know, like you said, a lot of people do love that kind of music and yeah. a lot of those elements are missing. And me, I'm personally a fan of 90s R&B, 2000s R&B, mm -hmm. you know, harmonies, you know, just the lyrics, the love, the passion and the, the effort and put into the overall production. So collaborating with Nico, she, she really contains all those elements of R&B. She like all things R&B. So she, she's amazing. So I figured, hey, we can put some great music together. All right, so speaking of music, tell us about the project that you guys are working on right now. Okay, so this song is called Love Me Better. So I produced it and I got with Nico. Take, I told her the concept, wanted it to be about being in a relationship after, you know, going through certain failed relationships, different mm -hmm. things, and almost wanting to give up on love, but finding that right one. And um, she took that vision for me and she executed it. And, you know, she could speak on it. Yeah, Nico, yeah, what do you love true. about R&B? That old school <laughs> love feeling that you get. Feeling, emotion, I feel like we lack that today. Um, so that's really my main reason for really studying R&B, really wanting to just translate that message. I feel like uh, my generation, we feel like we're too cool mm -hmm. to feel. So yeah, I want to bring back the feeling, the emotion, genuine feeling and emotion. Indeed. Now, we're missing one member who is Haley. Tell right. us about her. All right, so Haley, she's a singer as well, songwriter. So after um, working with or collaborating with Nico, I added her on a verse and she put some modern twist on it, I feel like, with the triplets flow. It's pretty good. And um, so she couldn't be here today, but she has a new song coming out this Friday titled um, Broken Promises. So October 6th, it'll be out on all platforms. She also was featured on um, Kid and Play's, Kid and Payroll's new uh, mixtape, nice. Kid and Pay, and that came out last Friday. So it's called Fell in Love. It's track eight on that new project. So go check that out. All right, so now I'm gonna ask one more time, what's the inspiration behind the song you're about to perform? Ooh. How does it translate for you, Nico? Because really you're the singer, you gotta feel it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. <laughs> um, it's definitely, uh, once again, feeling a lot of love put into it. And it kind of reminds me of like uh, early 2000s, like Bow Wow, that type of era. Mm -hmm. So yeah, that's how I feel about it. I love that song. Okay, well, we are excited to hear it. Please bring that R&B back. <laughs> Thank you both for being with us. Thank you. Now here is Nico Noir taking us to break with Love You Better. Only you bring me peace, you give me tranquility. Oh, never taking back what you mean, you give me love for the meaning. If I fall, I know you catch me with both hands. I think about you more than I ever could admit. I want to be you, forget about being in your skin. You're the only one that ever seemed to get it. You listen, I had to go through the worst to get to the better. Oh, oh, we so put together, you so put together. Loving don't sound so bad when it's coming from you. Reminisced on my past, some things we can't undo. Loving don't sound so bad, not that bad with you at all. At all. Thought I never have something real, something true. I'm a fear about you. You the first option if, if I even got a list. It feel like a second chance every time we touch like this. Cause you're the only one I could ever see me with. 